Hello everybody. Welcome back to another session of Mathematics Made Easy. Today our topic is number system. Now the question is, find the reminder when 2 power 89 is divided by 89. So, for finding the reminder when 2 power 89 is divided by 89, we are going to use Fermat's theorem. Now, Fermat's theorem statement, a to the power of p minus 1, is congruent to 1 modulo p. So let us take 2 to the power of 89 minus 1. Here modulo 89, 89 is a prime number. So a to the power of p minus 1, 2 power 89 minus 1 is congruent to 1 modulo 89. Then this is 2 to the power of 88 is congruent to 1 modulo 89. But actually we need to find what is the reminder when 2 power 89 is divided by 89. So we should make this 2 power 88 as 2 power 89. For that multiply both LHS and RHS with 2. We get 2 power 88 into 2 is congruent to 1 into 2 modulo 89. It becomes 2 to the power of 88 plus 1 is congruent to 1 into 2 is 2 modulo 89. So 2 to the power of 89 is congruent to 2 modulo 89. So when 2 power 89 is divided by 89, reminder is 2. Now the question is, what is the reminder when 11 power 35 is divided by 55? Now 11 power 35 is divided by 55. What is the reminder? For finding the reminder, when 11 power 35 is divided by 55, we can write 11 power 35 as 11 into 11 to the power of 34. By denominator 55 is 5 into 11. Now we can cancel 11 in numerator and denominator. We have to find when 11 power 34 is divided by 5, what is the reminder? So we are going to use Fermat's theorem. So according to Fermat's theorem, a to the power of p minus 1 is congruent to 1 modulo p. When p is a prime number, a power p minus 1 is congruent to 1. When 11 to the power of 5 minus 1 is congruent to 1 modulo 5, here 5 is a prime number. So 11 power 5 minus 1 is congruent to 1 modulo 5. It can be written as 11 to the power of 4 is congruent to 1 modulo 5. Now, we have to make this 11 to the power of 4 as 11 to the power of 34. Then, for that, take whole to the power of 8 in both LHS and RHS. 11 to the power of 4 whole to the power of 8 is congruent to 1 to the power of 8 modulo 5 it becomes 11 to the power of 4 into 8, 32, is congruent to 1, modulo 5. But actually we have to make it as 11 to the power of 34. So multiply both LHS and RHS with 11 square. Then it becomes 11 to the power of 32 into 11 square is congruent to 1 into 11 square, modulo 5. Then... 11 to the power of 32 into 11 square. It becomes 11 to the power of 32 plus 2, 34. Is congruent to 1 into 11 square is 121 modulo 5. Then 11 to the power of 34 is congruent to when 121 is divided by 5, we get the remainder 1 modulo 5. Then when 11 to the power of 34 he is congruent to 1 modulo 5. It is nothing but when 11 power 35 is divided by 55, remainder is 1.